backpacking trip. Say hi to Dan. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. What is Dan doing? <laughs> Trying to get out of the <laughs> So there's 51 ways in. A little tour of the tent site. Let's see, that's where Jen spent the night the last time. That spot was empty. I don't think that uh, fire pit was there. It's really quite wide open. I think there's some tents that can fit over there. And Dan's tent, that's where ours was. This was the spot with the tree that was tied up, but I think, no, maybe that was. That's fixed up a little bit more. And this is a little fancier. kitchen area. Nice. Did it make it?
Yeah, I'd go all the way. Well, actually, almost all the way. There you go. That'll keep the squirrels off. Uh, nope, not there. Do it to the tree. Huh? Do it to the white tree. What? Oh, yeah. Bears are smart enough to see the rope and chew the rope. But they won't see the rope over here. Well, it'll be harder for them to get to. Go ahead, for Anna's prosperity. So we survived the night on our way back. A little bit of water on the trail, nothing too terrible. Head there. Right straight ahead. This is. That's the trail. Much more, like, much less uh, vegetation than last year. This year's yeah, way, way less. And this part is definitely more obvious that yeah. it's the trail. The trail goes through there, through the trees. to where the dam is, right there. Okay, Pauline, go through. Mm -hmm. That's a lot smaller. You can get across the wet feet. There we go. That wasn't so bad. <laughs> Good idea. This is what Ann is missing. Yeah, we actually came across. It must have been right there where we went across the last time. Quite a piece of engineering. Up there. I don't know, this doesn't look too bad. Yeah, it's just that right there. Yeah, I think the wall going to look busted for us.
Yeah, I was wondering. I thought that might, might be more difficult going the other way. 